Hey everybody, uh, my name is Kathleen. Um, so for this N of 1 assignment, um, starting and looking back from when I was still uh, in utero, I was lucky. Um, my family was pretty well off when my mom was pregnant with me. She was married to my dad um, and they were doing pretty well. So that translated, I think, into a lot of resources for my mom. Um, she got consistent care uh, when she was pregnant with me, which definitely was helpful. Um, and I think had a lot of the right information and resources to act on all the stuff that you need to know to take care of your baby. Um, and she definitely was really interested in childhood health and uh, nutrition and everything like that. So she was able to really by a result of that education and also her financial circumstances, um, able to put a lot of energy into taking care of me and my brothers, um, breastfeeding, all that kind of thing. Um, after I was a little, little kid, my mom separated, re remarried to my stepdad. So overall, I had a pretty stable economic environment growing up. Um, and that translated into access into resources like other people have mentioned, healthcare, uh, dental care, um, stuff like that. So those were definitely important. Uh, probably the most important and, and salient feature of uh, family for me and growing up was uh, my mom wanted to homeschool me and my brothers. So we got the opportunity to, I think, engage with a learning environment a little bit differently and kind of uh, have a, a lot more flexibility like we've talked about um, in some of the materials about like how your environment shapes your health. Um, I was at home, we got to eat home cooked food and all that kind of stuff, which was really, really good for us. Um, growing up after kind of middle childhood times, um, we had, um, let's see, I'm trying to think what else is interesting or relevant here health wise. Um, I was able to kind of be an autonomous agent for myself, my early 20s. Um, went to school, took some time off, now I'm back. Um, I think my time and like interfacing with the educational system in college is another big, big deal that's kind of shaped my health. Um, and like we're all kind of aware, that's why we're here getting bachelor's degrees, because um, it's gonna improve access to resources over my life course. So besides those acute things, I'm trying to think what else is really interesting or relevant. I um, guess the only other real thing that comes to me for my environment and health is a big cyclist. Um, that's one of those things, too, that I think I wouldn't be able to do necessarily if it wasn't for where I'm at. Um, living in Portland, obviously, is a pretty bike-friendly city, so even though that's a personal decision that I make, it's really interesting to look at how the context of being a Portlander has really helped to shape that for me. Anyway, thanks, guys.